Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. I'm Leanna. And I am Christine. If you are new, welcome. So this video is gonna be a collab with Christine. Yes, um, I actually have some YouTube videos of my own for those of you that are trying to or are interested in joining the military. I gave a lot of informational experiences about um, my process, so hoping it could help you guys. And I haven't made a videos in a while, so hopefully I can get back into that. <laughs> so if you're interested in that, I'm gonna have her channel linked down below. But this video is going to be about our Crazy Cas Boys haul. So my last video that I posted was my Crazy Cas Boys haul that I did with David. And if you haven't seen that, basically what Crazy Cas Boys is, it is, I guess, kind of like a liquidation sale type area, right? Is yeah, I think called? like Amazon just yeah. collects all the things that they can't resell. Mm -hmm. and, and then they, they sell them in bins there. And this is actually her first time going. Yeah, I had never heard of Crazy Cas Boys. I was like, what the hell is this? So um, she told me you have to like download an app and like mm -hmm. check in. It's like super serious. And then David actually went at like 6.30 in the morning to wait in line. And then we kind of went a little bit after, but I didn't realize how serious it was. Um, we went on Friday. Friday's like the big day to go. Mm -hmm. Everything is $7. So everything in this haul we got for $7. And then I'm just gonna talk about how much it retails for. So let's get into the video. Alrighty. Keep in mind that some of the products we bought was either one for ourselves or two for us to resale. So the next couple of products we're going to be recording is going to be baby products. So I don't know a lot about baby stuff, but I know that she does. Yeah, so during the summer, um, if you follow me, you know that I was briefly pregnant and then I had my miscarriage. But while I was pregnant, I started doing a lot of research, obviously like on baby items. So this one item, the Nano Bebe, I know that this one, um, it's like a really good brand name and just the silicone bottles period for babies. So I got this and this one retails for $25. <laughs> the next item is from the first tiers and it is a three-in-one bottle warmer and this one retails for $30 the next item is also a baby warmer it is from Philips and this one retails online for $40 we have yet again another <laughs> baby warmer and this one's different from the other one. The only difference, um, like the main physical difference that I see on it is the dial knob on it. But this one retails for $50. All right, the last item in our baby section is this baby food cooker maker. And obviously it's just a baby food maker. You but it looks super food. fancy. Yeah, it does look really fancy. It kind of reminds me of um, like a food processor. But this one is worth $65. So the first item in our kitchen section is this nostalgia chocolate fondue fountain. I already have it out of the box to show you. Um, basically, just what I wanna show you guys, just like keep in mind that when you're buying from, a, from this store or even like stores like this, that since they are returned items, some of the stuff could either be used or not in the greatest condition that you think you're gonna get it for. So like when I took this out of the box, there's already like, it looks like grease from people's hands and stuff. And it also does look like it's been used. So you definitely wanna like sanitize and wash all of your stuff before you use it. And this one retails for $25. I still think you got it for a pretty good deal. Yeah. Though, even though it's like used, it's like open box, but for like a way bigger deal. Yeah, and I mean, it's a, it's a kitchen item. It's not like, a bathing suit or so, you know like yeah. you get what i'm saying yeah yeah, it's, yeah it's, it's it can be easily like sanitized and cleaned and stuff so yes no big deal the next item in the kitchen section is this portable blender so the box looks all crappy but i opened it and inside it has everything and everything is brand new it has not been used and this blender retails for $30. The next item that I bought is a kettle, and since I've used it already, I'm just gonna insert a clip of me using it. Online, it retails for $50, which honestly, I've been trying to look for one for a really good price, and mm -hmm. I haven't been able to, because I just like have it in my cart, and like I haven't been wanting to buy it, but for seven bucks for mm -hmm. a kettle, yeah. And it's a really nice kettle, so. Yeah, yeah definitely. That thing, that thing yeah. up in like two seconds. Yeah, so it was definitely a great deal. And again, it was brand new. So brand new for $50, or brand new retails $50, got for $7, like that's a great deal. Yeah. So now we're gonna go into household items. 
So the first item for that is this vacuum. And this one retails for $47. It is handheld and it's cordless. Um, I got two of these. Now, both of them were in good condition. One of them though, like, the back of it had like little scratches and stuff, but the filter is brand new. It doesn't look like it's been used. And then the other box was missing some of the extra- um, Like attachments? Yeah, the attachments on it. But I mean, $47, $7, yeah. I mean- And I'm pretty sure they're just scratched because most of the stuff, they don't have like, like the shipping paper or mm -hmm. like the styrofoam or the things that kind of keep it together. I'm pretty sure it's just scratched up from just been like moving in a box mm -hmm. and stuff, so. Yeah. The last item in this household section is another vacuum. And this one's a Bissell one, it's the pet hair remover. I have it out of the box just because the actual box is just brown itself, so you can't really see what it is. But this one retails for, how much? $70. 70 bucks. <laughs> and again, like it's brand new, like the filter is clean and everything, so. $70 versus $7, it's really good. So now we're gonna do some like self-care hygiene kind of category. So the first item is a uh, all-in-one trimmer. So the last time she tried to get a trimmer, she got a pet clippers, which were actually really decent pet clippers, but this time she saw this one and now she can actually gift her husband this. Yeah, because I mean, David's not gonna trim his damn body with some <laughs> pet clippers. But this was actually a lot nicer. Kind of honestly, it looks a little similar like the pet one. But yeah, so now he finally has his own razor, which retails for $45, and we got it for seven. So, yeah. so the last item in my little hygiene section is this toothbrush, which, which I wanted to take from her, yeah, but it is. Oh my god, this, okay, so first, David's been wanting an electric toothbrush for so long, and so have I, but he told me, he's like, look, when you go, all I want is a toothbrush, and I'm like, okay. And then we found this one, and now I think I just want to keep it for myself, but it retails for $158. So now we're in our miscellaneous section, and the first thing I'm gonna show is this Infinity Saga, like, mystery box. And I couldn't get an exact price online on how much this was just because um, I think it was a subscription that people like got monthly and it was over with already so I didn't get to see the price. But on eBay, some people sell it as cheap as $25 and as expensive as $60. So this one, um, I'm gonna open it. It shows that it comes with five different things but it didn't come with the sticker and the pin but it came with a shirt. And, and then a cute little collectible. Pop, Funko Pops, yeah. Yeah. It has a Captain America one, and then that one is the Nick Fury one. So the next item was a um, microphone for the camera. So I actually found this for her. I like literally thought that this would be perfect mm -hmm. for her since she does the YouTube videos and stuff. So yeah. <laughs> this one retails for $46, and I was looking at the reviews, and honestly, um, like this has really high reviews on YouTube. So the last item in this haul is this fascia gun. Now. The funny thing about this is that we had another friend who came with us and he had this in his cart and I had a different massage gun in mine. And when I saw this, I was like, yo, I'll trade you. Like, let's trade. Let me get this one because he already has one at home. He's like, cool, we'll trade. I get home. I'm going to show you what it looks like because, I mean, it still looks really good, you know? Take it out. Like, looks good, everything. I get home. I plug it in, I try turning it on, and like, this thing does not work at all. And it came with two cords, like, it has two separate cords within everything, and I tried everything to getting this thing to work, and it doesn't work. So again, <laughs> like, when you're buying stuff from stores like this, like, you never know what you're getting, like, everything's a gamble. But I told him to try his massage gun, the one that I gave him and that shit works, so. <laughs> <laughs> Kinda sucks, but I basically have a paperweight, but I mean, it retails for $90, so if it would've worked, that would've been a great, like, yeah. fine. But you only spent $7 for yeah. it, so. So this is going to be the end of my haul. I ended up buying 16 items. I spent 120, 
and retail price everything is worth about $868 so that's a pretty good price difference some of the stuff I am keeping some of the stuff I do want to sell so I already know the stuff that I do want to sell I will be able to make my money back which I think it's pretty good but now we're going to um, end this video and give you like a little suspense because I actually got a bunch of stuff myself mm -hmm. so if you guys want to watch that video she's going to link it below and um and <laughs> and something that she got was a Nutribullet. So she has some pretty good stuff. So I definitely recommend seeing her haul and seeing all the stuff that she was able to get. So don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Go ahead and like it, share, subscribe to my channel if you have not already. Drop any comments below of any future videos you wanna see. Honestly, I'm hoping these crazy cast boys videos are gonna be something that's regularly on my channel just because it's so much fun it is shopping and getting everything but until next time bye guys bye Christine welcome to my I fucked that up <laughs> <laughs> I, did you ask me like what the fuck is you I'm like <laughs> <laughs> and this one retails for Do it again. Go ahead. 47. It's 47. Goddamn 47. I never said subscribe to my channel. <laughs> I give this video a thumbs up. <laughs>